Welcome to Rise and Grind. We are officially, now that we did America's Top Hat and had some Tim Hortons, starting our 50 state coffee challenge. That's right. I will be trying coffee from all 50 states. And uh, we're going to be going alphabetical. So the first state we will be trying is Alabama. Okay. So uh, for the first place, we're going to try Tumor's Coffee from Opelika, Alabama. Look at this stuff. I can tell you what. I got the breakfast blend because usually a breakfast blend is going to be a light to medium roast. And that's kind of my thing, you know. But, whoo, that smells good. So, uh, and first of all, thank you so much to Sandy and Trish. Uh, I let them know that uh, we are embarking on this little journey here and that they were going to be our first stop along our uh, statehood journey. And they sent two other kinds of coffee. That's right. This is going to be three videos all together. But uh, we're going to be starting with their breakfast blend. So a little bit about uh, Tumor's Coffee for you. It was founded in 2004 by Sandy and Trish when they got back from doing missionary work for over a decade. Um, I thought that was really cool. You know, a lot of times those missionaries, they're down there, you know, building houses, uh, helping the food supply, you know, doing what they can to help people and parts of the world that... Uh, Sadly, do not have as many blessings as we do in our life here. Um, always important to, you know, help those when you can. So I thought that was really cool. Anyway, in 2006, they had they added in-house coffee roasting. So they are a family-owned business, and they ship to all 50 states. That's right. You know, I'm going to be trying coffee from all 50 states, and uh, if we get viewers from all 50 states, guess what? You can try this coffee, too. And uh, I highly suggest you do. Just from the smell alone, I know it's going to be good. Um, <clears throat> so, a couple facts about uh, tumors. Uh, you know, when COVID came around, a lot of businesses suffered. You know, it was hard to make it by. You know, things were shut down and whatnot. So, like a lot of businesses... They highly relied on online shopping. And because of that, they not only survived, but they thrived. So it's always good to see these small businesses being able to make it out strong when stuff like COVID happens. Because we know, you know, a lot of these corporations are fine. But it's, you know, the mom and pop businesses that have a hard time getting by. Um, so they have a three-pronged approach. Be consistent. Be innovative, innovative, and be passionate. Uh, and be passionate, you know. And I really like that. It reminds me when I used to work for a brewery down in Sacramento, uh, King Kong Brewing Company. Their motto was community, quality, creativity. And you know, it's important to have some, you know, basic shared goals, vision for what you want with your project. So I really like that. Um, the Auburn blend is their best seller for over 20 years. We will be trying that, but not on this video. Now, what I thought was hilarious is being from Alabama, it's a civil war within the state. You got your Roll Tide Bama fans, and you got also your, you know, War Eagle Auburn fans. So... Don't worry, if you're a Bama fan and you cannot have anything in your house that has those word, or has the word Auburn, there's a Tuscaloosa blend. Same thing. I thought that was pretty cool. Um, so yeah, if you're in Alabama, go out, get a cup of coffee from these guys, buy a bag of beans, support your local coffee roasters. Friends don't let friends drink Starbucks, okay? And... Um, if you're from any other of the 50 states, like me, I'm from way up in Northern California, you still can support them. Go on. Buy a bag of their coffee. Try it out. What do you got to lose? Uh, nothing. The only thing you have to lose is nothing. Like I said, you'll gain everything as in energy and taste. All right. <laughs> and uh, one thing I also thought was great is they sell meat rub. Yeah. 
They sell Tumor's Espresso Meat Rub. And as someone who loves to barbecue, I'm going to definitely have to buy some of that so I can look at the mountain like I do when I barbecue. And, uh, yeah. Try some ribs with that rub. Check out those beans. Pretty, aren't they? So we got some freshly brewed breakfast blend. Say that three times fast. Freshly brewed breakfast blend from the fine people over at Tumor's Coffee. Let's have a sip. That is good. That is good. It's light. It's earthy. Very earthy, which I like. Um... I get a little citrusy from it. It is so good. Um, yeah, so first coffee out of all 50 states from Opelika, Alabama. Tumor's Coffee Breakfast Blend. Delicious. <clears throat> so next time we will have another coffee by them and the next time another coffee by them and by that point we will be on to alaska and that is on its way in the mail so can't wait for that cheers everybody support your local roasters friends don't let friends drink starbucks <laughs>